Hi everyone, this is Manisha and welcome back to Stheta. I am so excited about today's video because I am starting a series of reaction videos. There are so many videos, reels, movies, advertisements are out there which are very influential and have been affecting us in a different ways. So I am going to take my spin on it and talk to you girls about how we can maintain our femininity and keep uplifting our personality regardless of what the society is feeding us. So let's get into this video today. Alright, so I have taken three reels today for this reaction video and all the three reels are based on the topic of neediness. There are so many people who are confused about what exactly neediness means. In brief, needing something out of someone is very simple. If you need something, you tell them what you need and then you see if the other person wants to meet your need or doesn't want to meet your need so if the person does want to meet your need then great if they don't then see if it's non-negotiable for you if it is non-negotiable then you move ahead you move on okay but neediness is something it comes from a deep down insecurity deep down trust issue that you don't trust that need will get met it comes from a childhood trauma where your needs were not met so anxious side of it feels the fear of abandonment if they express their needs the other person will leave they won't be with them so they never try to raise their standards uh, and express their needs what they want and the avoidance side of it is what's the point if the needs are not going to met i will directly show through my action what i want and i will not tell through my words what i want so th these two attachment styles tend not to express their needs and they become needy a little bit, okay? But the secure attachment style doesn't have that problem. So they just express their needs and then they see if the other person wants to meet their need or not. It's as simple as that. So let's get into the first reel. Uh, this is from a movie, but uh, I forgot the name of the movie. So let's jump into it directly. It's open. It's open. I don't go out on dates with guys who don't open the door for me. Really? Really. Seriously? Yes. Oh man. Alright. So <laughs> okay. Um do you girls really think that opening a car door is a need for you? Do you really think? See, needing something and wanting something is way two different things. I felt this girl was a little bit entitled. Open the car door for me, otherwise I won't go out on a date with you. That's a little bit entitled. You know, if you frame the sentence in a way, I would love it if you open the car door for me. You know, the guy will open the car door. I mean, trust me, men just want to see you happy. Okay, you don't have to express what you want in such a way. This was quite entitled for me. And... Uh, I understand there are many men who have been trained by these manners like opening the car door, pulling the chair and this and that. But there are many men who are not trained like this. Okay, but they do not have any problem if, if you express that this is what you like and you feel special when somebody does that. They will do it for you. If they love you, if they want to be in your life, they will do it for you. You do not, you do not have to talk like this. Alright, so this is what neediness kind of looks like where you give ultimatums, where you feel entitled a little bit, which comes from a little bit of insecurity that I won't go out on a date with you if you don't open the car door for me. Okay, this is this is the kind of attitude is something repel men away. Now this next video is about again opening the car door, but this girl is so playful and expressed what she wants in such a funny and playful way that any guy would open the car door for her. I love the hey. song. Hey. <laughs> what are you, come on, we gotta go. What are you doing? Come on. <laughs> Stop. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, now you see the difference. The first video, if you see how she reacted, I don't go out on a date with guys who don't open the car door for me. 
and you see the difference in the energy how playful and light this energy is so you can trust me you can express your needs in different ways if the man is not able to understand or anybody not just the man it's like your girlfriend your your mom your dad your brother sister anybody if you want to get your needs met you can try telling them in different ways the way they understand how it is important for you to get certain things most people most men specifically would want to meet your needs if you tell them if you communicate it to them very clearly okay trust me on that and if the man is not ready to meet your needs what the hell are you doing with such a man move on next video is a bride video where half of her dress is forgotten and she is literally standing at the altar okay and see how she reacts you will understand the difference in neediness and needing something all right i just realized when i got up to the end of the aisle that i'm missing half of my dress <laughs> I maybe i, I could put it on now I'm not kidding. Two two nights ago, I had a dream that I did this. That I I walked on the aisle without it. Two nights ago, I had a dream that I did this. Here comes the dream. I walked on the aisle without it. Oh my god! Oh my god. guys, look at her. She is. First of all, she's beautiful, but her energy is so calming. She's so. She's not at all stressed out. She she's like. Okay, I forgot my dress now, and I had a dream about it. So she just joked about it and like, can we have it now? Like, I know that we have forgotten the dress, but I'm standing at the altar. Can I have the dress now? This is what needing something looks like. She's not at all needy. She's such a pleasant personality. Okay, let let's watch the full reel. I'm sure you guys have never been to a wedding like this before. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we can resume. Ah, uh, I mean, look at her energy. I mean, there are many brides who will freak out for a little bit of mistake if a makeup artist has done, if a dress person has made a mistake. the bride will freak out but can you see her reaction i'm not saying that you have to be all doll and all happy all the time you can have no problem ever in in your life you can never get triggered you can never lose patience i'm not saying that but if a, if you're being with a person who's an avoidant and who's like literally not ready to meet your needs i would suggest move on seriously if you are embodying more and more feminine energy and gratefulness in your personality trust me your personality will be much more calm and universe will give you what you want and all of your needs will be met and trust me if one or two needs are not met you won't be that triggered so you need to embody more and more feminine energy and just trust people that if you express your needs it will be met So that's it for today's video. I hope you like it. Let me know in the comments below what you think about this reaction video. And every Wednesday I will be posting a reaction video. Every Friday I will be posting a vlog about feeling good Friday. And every Monday I will be posting videos about mindful Mondays where we talk about everything related to wellness of women and uplifting the personality and becoming the best version of ourselves. So subscribe to the channel, press the bell icon and I will see you in the next video. Say what you want to say.